things. I'm certainly not. If there's something we're missing, we will figure it out later. <laughs> anyway, welcome everyone. Last time we managed to defeat Sweetheart. And also nearly drowned. You know, so swings and roundabouts. <laughs> this time... Sonny's living his best life. <laughs> He's certainly living a life. <laughs> this time, let's see what Hero is gonna do in town. Let's talk to Aubrey, and then let's see what's past the beach in Dream World. Hell yeah, hell yeah. Alright, art plug away for once. Let's oh. get oh. going. Hey, Sand. Hey, Sand. <laughs> yeah, sorry, we just completely forgot to send the announcement last time. It was great. A plus. Alright, I have I do not remember what we're doing. Is Basil in here? We were taking Basil home. Cool, let's check out Basil's grandma first. Is she still here and still comatose? Yeah. A white egret orchid. In the language of flowers, it symbolizes the phrase, My thoughts will follow you into your dreams. What a, sp what a very specific flower meaning. Yeah. Uh, for, for context, um... We made it out of the castle, Hero's back, Basil nearly drowned, Aubrey... Aubrey... We ruined Aubrey's day for a second time in a row. I mean, to be fair, she did surround... Ba she did give Basil a rather severe panic attack. According to them, they were just asking him to leave, and he did just start breaking out. I mean, I, yeah. I, it's not necessarily on them. It's not necessarily on them, but they certainly weren't helping. Yeah, that, that was a situation where I think all of them needed to settle down and none of them did. Everybody loses! <laughs> I've been taking care of Basil for two years already, but I barely know anything about him. I wish he would open up about himself more. I just want to help. Cool. Basil's camera. It looks really dusty. Oh god, what does a Basil who's nearly drowned sound like? Figure it out. Golden light. What's golden light? Oh, Sunny. There's no way out of this, is there? Basil's been through so much these past few days. Basil, you must be tired. Please, get some rest. We'll come back for you tomorrow. Oh, I guess we're just going. So Basil's doing great. He's, he's doing his best. You know, Sonny, you were pretty awesome back there. Jumping into the lake to save Basil like that? Even if Hero ended up saving the day, I think you deserve some recognition too. How about a high five? Do we want yes. a high five? Yes. Cool. Come on, that was so violent. <laughs> of course it was violent, it's Kel. <laughs> oh yeah, Kel's, Kel's doing good. So Dave, what, what's your thoughts on maybe having Sand voice some characters at some point? I mean, I'd be down for it. I was actually about to ask you. I just got distracted by a <laughs> hero who apparently also punches people to death. Fun. <laughs> no one here needs weapons except for Kel. Yeah, but in that case, we're gonna have to migrate over to Nashi's Discord. Yeah. So uh, maybe, maybe not today, just because I am a little... Uh, uh, tired. Alright, maybe we'll do it on Thursday. We won't have a stream yeah. on Friday due to reasons. Or we might, but it certainly won't be a Mori and Ash won't be here. Yeah, cause Friday I will be traveling. Yeah. Oi, Hero, how do you feel about Mari? 
Like I yeah, know Sand, it would be fun having you on for other streams. I think that could be a lot of fun. Yeah. I'm trying to think, what do we want to have? What are we going to do that's not voiced? Because I feel like I want to do a game that has voice acting next time. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> I don't know if I'm ready for this yet. Oh, okay. Fair enough. Yeah, we have been playing um, text-heavy games for a hot minute. God, what was the last one again? Binary Domain was the last fully voiced one. Fair enough. Oh, right, the last one we did was CrossCode. Yes. <laughs> uh. Oh, yeah, we have $22. Before we actually go to Kel's place, we have something very important we have to do. Oh. Yeah, I mean, first off, we may as well check to see if we've got... No, we do not have trash. Crosscode 2. Ten times the dialogue. <laughs> Crosscode 2. We already did that. That was the DLC. <laughs> <laughs> the orange cat looks hungry. Buddy, give me two seconds. Get that funny orange cat some fish. Fish. Both of them. Oh my goodness. Yes, babe? <laughs> We're going all in for these cats. Of course, we have a healer now. We have a healer, we've got bandages. I don't think we have a single way to restore juice out, out here in the overworld, unless, unless generic healing items restore juice. Perhaps. You never know. Either way, we don't have any generic snacks. Oog. The cat left a gift for you. You got trash. <laughs> I mean, Good. Hey, I mean, hey, money's money. Can't argue with that. Nah, this guy was just in a different spot earlier. Same. Same dialogue. Ah, oh, that's lame. Huh, I think she's giving more money for each bit of trash today. I... I guess that would make sense? Because we definitely only had one bit of trash on us, but we got three dollars. I'm sensing an evil <laughs> presence coming from inside my home. Maybe I'm overthinking it, but I can never be too careful. Eh. Still, now we know where the Maverick lives. Very fun. Ooh. Do you want to play with Hector? Show me that funny dog. The best. The best doggy. The only doggy. <laughs> yeah, unfortunate timing, Sand. It is unfortunate <laughs> timing, but you have to realize we've done like three text heavy games in a row, and what on earth is going on with my leg? Oog. Ah, nothing ridiculous. Kel. Hero. Where have you two been? It's so late. I've been worried sick. Sorry, Mom. We got held up. But the good news is we found Basil and he's safe. Hm. I'll have you know, I spent all week preparing the chicken roast for tonight's dinner. And... It's gotten cold. Oh, Mom. Please don't cry. Sorry, Mom. That's what microwaves are for. Uh... I mean, we did have... we did have another nightmare sequence, technically. We, we went into a pit uh, of a library full of memories, uh, and we had a, a fun basil scene. Yeah, also the shadow child was down there, and I... S and he might not have had photorealistic eyes, but the effect was close enough. He was playing the piano for us. <laughs> yeah, but then we spooked him out. Oh, my poor dinner! 
There, there, honey. Cheer up. <laughs> Wait, I think I had a voice for this guy. Today's a special day. There's no need to be sad. I can't do it. Tragic. I think it was just one of my su I think it was just my singular southern accent. <laughs> which I do not have on call right now. Look. Unfortunate. Hero's back from college. It's good to see you back, champ. Thanks, Dad. Oh, your dad is right. This is no time for sniffles. It's good to see you back, Hero. We've all missed you so much. Oh, right, it's the kid. The child. Oh, yeah, there's a teeny little baby. That sounds like Sally's awake. I'll go get her. Come on, boys. You must be hungry. I swear, I feel like... I swear, I don't know where my southern accent went, because it feels like I'm, like, this close to veering into an Australian accent with Kel's dad. Your accents are just all over the place. Go on and help yourselves to dinner. Ugh. Cool. Let's go grab some food and heat it up. Alright, let's go get a steak real quick. <laughs> Just microwave it. I got a home cooked meal, but it's cold. Look, Hero, we got your favorites. Some chocolate chip cookies and a big old Hero sandwich. Ah, uh, how sweet. It's exactly the same as last year. <laughs> I mean... Oh, poor Hero. Yeah, imagine you come back home after a year away at college. And to celebrate, your family got you Subway. You know, they're doing their best. The door is locked. Well, I've heard good things about Sam and Max. Is it like... That, cause, point cause and click adventure. Like, yeah, the point and clicks. I'm aware of them, never actually seen that much of them. Now that everything's calmed down, we can finally relax a bit. It's so good to see you again, Sonny. It really has been way too long. Oh, and it's good to see you again too, Cal. So, Sonny, I heard from Mom that you're moving away soon. That sounds so exciting. Yeah, he is. Tomorrow's gonna be his last day with us. Moving might seem kind of nerve-wracking now, but it really isn't so bad once you get used to it. I think it'd be good for you, Sonny. You learn a lot moving to a new place, and it's nice to have a fresh start. I'm a little sad to see you go, but it'll be okay as long as we keep in touch. Ooh, the remake is one of those situations, huh? Ah. Uh... We sure did have a lot of memories together. Sometimes I miss those days. Lazing around, eating food, drinking juice. <laughs> awesome kill. I think you need to understand, when he says juice, he means orange gel. <laughs> it's horrible <laughs> potion to destroy your teeth. <laughs> the unholy combination of soda and orange juice. God, it, it was not soda, it was coffee. Coffee and orange juice. <laughs> I always get that mixed up. Your teeth, your teeth disintegrate when you drink it. It's a disintegration potion, but it only works on bones. <laughs> how to hide a bot, how to get rid of a skeleton in one easy step. <laughs> yeah, we did everything together. We went to the park, the lake, the beach. But honestly, what I miss the most is hanging out at your place, Sonny. You guys had everything. A big TV, all the newest toys, a grand pi A grand piano? How the fuck are we hiding that? <laughs> Probably in one of the rooms we don't enter. <laughs> it's not a closet, that's actually the entire second half of the house. <laughs> and of course, our very own treehouse. Oh, that's why we- that's why Sunny doesn't want to go out back, because the treehouse is there. Um, oh yeah, the treehouse was awesome. I wonder if it's still there. Is it, Sunny? <laughs> Looks like the food's done. Let's eat in the living room. We can continue chatting there. What, you're just gonna leave your dad at the table? 
I mean, he's having fun. <laughs> I offered to help your mom cook for dinner tonight, but you know how she is in the kitchen. Make sure to tell her how good her food tastes. You say that, but also you went ahead and got, like, just Subway for your kid. <laughs> they, they made a chicken roast and then they also just went and got Subway. It's very strange. They got cookies. They got it from a pizza place. Not even, like, name brand Subway. <laughs> By the way, hero. <laughs> Knock off Subway. Basil gave Sunny his photo album yesterday. Did you want to see it? You have Basil's photo album on you? Sure, let's look through the cal- let's look through the album when we eat dinner. What were you trying to say there? I think I almost said calendar. Awesome. <laughs> Again, I think we went through all these. We did, we've gone through them a couple times I think. Yeah, like I don't think there's anything new in here. No, no. This is still a cute photo. There's, there's a lot of cute art. Yeah, why do you think Nashi went ahead and ordered them all in? Because she's a genius. Yeah, alright, let's that, see. That was one of the scribbled out ones. Yeah, it was. I'm trying to remember. Because, like, we know this one was scribbled out. Uh, I think this one might have been. It's hard to say. Just This one was definitely scribbled oh, out. Scribbled out. It's hard to say because they were scribbled out. Yeah, you're relying on a lot. Not to mention it's been a hot minute since we've seen them. <laughs> Just a bit. That was two streams ago. This one was scribbled out. Yes. Yes, it was. I think this one might have been. It's, again, very hard to tell. Are you done looking at the photo? them being scribbled out makes it hard to identify. It's too bad that some photos are missing. Aubrey stole the album from Basil, but we got it back. Maybe she has the rest of the photos. Hero's about to go. Hero's about to go murder Aubrey. Hero teleporting into Aubrey's home. Uh, hey, Hero, what's up? Are you okay? Yeah. It's just that, well, Mari isn't in any of these photos. Oh, you're right. She isn't. Still, this album really brings back some good memories. Things were a lot simpler when we were all kids. <laughs> Sunny, I have a favor to ask. Do you, think, do you think you could let us see your house one more time before you leave? Oh, good idea. But you gotta convince Mom first. She's probably gonna be kinda mad about you not spending enough time with her and stuff. You know how she is. There it is, the child. <laughs> the child. Phew, what a mess that was. Thought we made little doo doo, but she's all clean now. <laughs> hey there, Sally. Peekaboo. <laughs> Good oh. job, Mel. Oog. Stop it, Kel. You're scaring her. <laughs> <coughs> so, uh, hey, Mom. We were wondering if we could go hang out at Sunny's house today since he's moving away soon. God. I don't think Hero's good with small children. <laughs> Fair enough. Oh, but you just came back. And it's already so late. What about spending time with your mom? I'm going to be here for the rest of summer, and Sunny's leaving the day after tomorrow. But you have plenty of time to catch up. I think it's okay for Hero to spend some time with Kel and Sunny. I haven't seen Sunny around for a long time now. It's been a while since the boys have had the chance to hang out. I say we should let them. <sighs> Fine then. You boys can have your fun. But Hero has to wash the dishes with me for the next week. Sure. I guess I can do that. Hm. Alright, you're free to go. Come on, Sally, let's leave your mean old brothers alone. They don't want anything to do with us, do they, Sally? God. Oh, Mom. 
Alright, the mom's kind of like that, so that's fun. Very fun. Fun, fun times. Eh. I still can't get over fucking roast chicken and also Subway. <laughs> and also we got your favorite takeout. <laughs> hey. So, I'm really glad that we get to hang out and everything. But I also feel pretty bad for leaving Mom all alone. <laughs> Buddy, she'll live. She has like... I, she she is, can handle herself. <laughs> she's got at least 20 years on you, and she definitely doesn't need you holding her hand. <laughs> Before we head to your house, let's go to fix it and get some flowers for her. I know she'd really appreciate that. Oh, I see our flowers already. I think we should go get my mom some fresh ones, though. Fix it isn't that far off, anyway. Hero. Always a mama's boy. Eh. Uh, what are the stereotypes about the Order of Children? Like, the eldest is always really put upon or something? Yeah, because it's the thing where, like, they kind of get relied on way too much. Yeah. Alright, buddy. Welcome to Fix It, where you can buy stuff and fix it yourself. What can I interest you in? Ooh, before I forget, Sunny, here's some money for my mom's flowers. You didn't think I would let you pay for it, did you? You got ten dollars! Nice. Wow. We had to rob Kel for so much of that. <laughs> Welcome back, Sand. Your internet is fighting against you. Uh, your internet is fighting for control. It doesn't want you experiencing the sheer power of a goddamn couple here. The, the, the uprising is happening right now. Mom's gonna love these flowers. Let's drop them off at my place, honey. Alright, real quick, what's the most fucked up machine you can think of to gain sentience first? God, I don't know. But like... Like, fucked up in terms of what? For humanity? Not in terms of humanity, just like in terms of... Man, wouldn't it suck if your sole purpose was to like... I don't know, mine crypto. Yeah, like, like a Bitcoin miner or like a <laughs> crash test dummy or something. Yeah. Fucking no! It one of those stupid self-driving cars that needs to be in a tunnel. You physically can't open the doors in to self-drive. Oh my god! I forgot about that one. Hmm. It looks like it's getting pretty late. We should probably head to your house right after this. That sound good to you? Yeah, sure. I don't like there's anything else to do. No. I guess we could go see if we can break down Aubrey's door, but. Yeah, I don't think she wants to talk to us right now. Or ever. <laughs> God! <laughs> Welcome, everyone, back to the Pegasus Charm Voice. Hey, Mom, I got you some flowers. Uh, oh, are these for me? They're beautiful. Thank you. We got them from the Hobby Lobby. You know, the only place to get flowers. Hero, you're such a charmer. Just like your old man. I'm sorry for overreacting earlier. I know Sunny's moving away soon. Try your best to keep in touch. Friends are hard to make the older you get. So depressing. I mean, I don't know. The only friend I personally have made was... <laughs> after I became an adult, so you know. You guys made friends with me, not the other way around. <laughs> we we forced the friendship upon you. You had no say in the matter. We'll be fine. Yes, I'm sure you will be. Take care, Sonny. Know that you'll always have a home here. Oh, Sand, I hate when they do that, when they, they release a remake so they just make the originals impossible to find. That shit sucks. Shout out to Dark Souls Remastered. Oog. 
Didn't they also do that with the the GTA remaster where like they they made it and then they immediately unlisted the the, the original games? Uh, maybe did the Oxo games do that? I don't think so. I think it's more that just they're very old games that were never properly ported ah, fair anywhere. Enough. Wow, it just hit me. It's been so long since we've been inside your house, even though we live right next door. Time really flies, huh? Yeah, it sure does. <laughs> Let's go inside. After you, Sunny. I get to see Sunny's horrible setup. I'll reiterate, Sunny has not done any of those, like, moving chores. Nope. Whoa, this place is cleared out, Sonny. Your house feels a lot bigger now that nothing's here. There used to be a couch here where we'd watch TV. We'd all come over every week and watch cartoons in the morning. And this is the stain from that one time I spilled my orange Joe. Mari got so mad at me. Well, that's because our cat stepped in and walked all over the house. <laughs> oh yeah, huh? Oh man, it looks like it's getting too dark to go see the treehouse. That's okay. Maybe we can come back tomorrow. Wait, I have an idea. What if we just stay over for the night? It's gonna be our last time in this house forever, right? And when will be the next time we can spend the night with Sunny like this? I'd love to, but Mom's not gonna be too happy about it. Buddy! One of your childhood friends is moving away forever, and this is the first time you've seen him in years since his sister died. Your mom can fucking shove it. You can chill out for two seconds. He'll be fine. Sand is being attacked by internet corporations. <laughs> I'm tired of waking up at night because of Sally's crying anyway. You're gonna wash dishes with mom for an entire week, aren't you? You deserve this. Well, that's true. It'll probably be fine. We live right next door, so we'll only be a walk away. Imagine we just don't go to Dream World because, like... Imagine if we just don't end up going to Dream World tonight because we ended up fucking having a sleepover. There's, there's just no more Dream World. The game's just gonna end like this. Yeah, like, there's... Empty. Like, I know for a fact that if we just stayed inside, the dream world itself would be bigger somehow. I'm not sure how, but there'd probably be, like, more to certain castles. There's definitely an element of, like, route choice and how that affects the dream world, because I've been- I, I've seen, like, some vaguely spoilery stuff on it. Yeah. Oh, I remember this hallway. The closet was to the left, and the piano room was to the right. What the- I wonder if the piano's still there. I'll go on ahead and see. Wait, you're telling me that there's a closet over here that we can't see or perceive? Did they just paper it over? <laughs> they didn't, because the mom specifically mentioned it. Um... Huh. It's kind of weird that... Okay, so the grand piano is something associated with Mari, but that wasn't... But the shadow figure's not Mari, so that's interesting. It's a very strange association that I'm curious to see uh, where it goes. <laughs> Mari actually got killed by that piano from Super Mario 64. It's like that line from, from Trolls, P piano killed Mari. <laughs> Don't touch me too hard. I haven't practiced in a while. Hero. Hero, go off! <laughs> Show off. <laughs> I guess I still got it. Almost like I still got that third part of Sam and Max from the original season. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Sunny, that reminds me. Do you still play the violin? Oh. It's not here. 
I guess you already packed it up. There's this song you used to play with Mari. It still gets stuck in my head sometimes, but I don't remember what it's called. You two would play it over and over. We'd even hear it from our house sometimes. What was it again? I like the idea that Sunny literally hadn't said a single thing, like, at all. It does seem like people are kind of talking around him. It's very interesting. Yeah. How come Hero still remembers how to play out good and stuff? I can barely even read sheet music anymore. That's why you gotta memorize the mnemonic, Kel, and then you'll always remember how to read sheet music. Yeah. I'm glad that someone's been taking care of Mari's piano. There's barely any dust at all. That's a good question. Who's been dusting the piano? Because mom's been gone for like half a week now. At least. What on earth is this? It's a giant portrait window. Cardboard boxes. This bookcase has been cleared out. One of two old grandfather clocks. They stopped working a long time ago, but mom likes to keep them around. Okay, babe, you've got a question about your stream title. Okay, to okay, Basil got dunked in the Basil got dunked in the lake and nearly drowned. I thought we'd be doing more Basil stuff. Fair. It did seem like they were setting him up, and then he just kind of went to sleep. Yeah, I mean, I mean, Basil doesn't seem to be doing too well. If that last conversation was anything to go by, never seems to be doing too well. That's his defining character trait. Yeah, a grand piano. The word Amori is etched across the s What? Okay. I guess that's why Amori is called Amori, but why? <laughs> why would that be there etched across the real world piano? With this piano that we are missing. Yeah, because this, this is the piano from the library in the nightmare world. Maybe Amori is like the brand name? I mean, maybe, but that seems weird. Ooh. Man, all of a sudden, I'm getting really sleepy. Maybe we should call it a night. That sounds good to me. I have to get up early for a morning jog anyway. So where should we sleep, Sunny? Probably somewhere in your room, right? I remember you used to hate sleeping alone. Now that sounds fun. We can sleep on the floor, if anything. Let's go find some blankets. Hold on, Kel. Wait for me. What, are you gonna start going through boxes? Eh, uh, probably not. They're probably expecting more blankets to be somewhere in the building. Hmm. Oh, hey, Mari. Uh, hey, Mari. You gonna jump scare us? Nope. Mom's bed. The mattress is too hard for you to sleep comfortably. Oh, apparently Amori's tried that before. Sorry, Sunny's tried that before. They're distinct. Fair enough. Also, I love how Sunny's still level 1. He has gained no experience. Oh. Fuck. <laughs> hey, Mari. God. I hate everything. I'm just suing the game developer. I was wondering if there would be something weird in the mirror. I was expecting, uh, <laughs> fuck, what's his face? Percy? Yeah. Where's that dude from Percy? Why must I see this? I don't know. God damn it. I hate video games. <laughs> I hate video games. All my enemies are inside them. <laughs> All right. Every game, every day, I get tormented by video games. Every day, I think a video game is going to be fun. Every, every day, I am psychologically tormented like the small child was. Ah, hell yeah! Hey, Sunny, we built a bed for it. I hope you don't mind. This is all Kel's idea. I had nothing to do with it. By the way, Hero, Sunny and I got you a gift. Kel gave Hero's gift to Hero. You know, the gift. You know, the gift. The gift for Hero. That gift. <laughs> I wish I could remember that entire sequence. It's Papa's... It's Papa Chip's chip off the block... 
oh, cookbook. I'm not reading all that. I can't read. Yeah. Suddenly, I do not know. What was the bit? The poison. The poison for Cusco. The poison specifically for Cusco. The poison to kill Cusco. That poison. Something like that. It's been a hot minute uh, since I've seen the Emperor's New Groove. Do you remember this? I can't- I think Sand might have missed the... <laughs> creepypasta Mari. <laughs> Calamari, that's what we're gonna call that one. Oh, you know what, yes. Of course I do. Man, I remember when I wanted to be a cook. It seems so silly now. What, are you gonna be a doctor? It. Did, did, didn't, didn't they say he was trying to be a doctor? I can't remember. Oh yeah, he has and, medical training. And you can still be a cook, hero. Uh, it's okay. I don't have time for that anymore. But you really like to cook, don't you? And people have to eat, right? So like, why not? <laughs> I don't think it works that way, Kel. Good job. Just immediately conked out. He's such a fast sleeper. Always been that way, I guess. Thanks for letting us sleep over, Sunny. I bet it's been pretty hard in this empty house, especially without Mari. I'm sorry I couldn't be there for you more. Everything feels so different now. But it seems like you've pretty much stayed the same. It's kind of relieving, to be honest. <laughs> <sighs> It's really nice to see you again. I just wish Aubrey and Basil could be here, too. Uh, anyway, sorry for ranting. It's getting late. I'll probably head to sleep soon, too. Good night, Sunny. I'll talk to you in the morning. <laughs> the best sleeping animation. Wonderful. A very comfortable bed. Would you like to go to sleep? Oh, can you not sleep in the blanket porch? Oh, right. Good question. There's no room for you. Oh, come on, gang. Yeah, they kind of kind of screwed the pooch on that one. <laughs> they fucked it up. Okay, but who the fuck came up with the phrase screwed the pooch? I don't know. That's probably one of those like ancient phrases that Oh, something's happening. Ooh. My hand is Oh. Ooh. Hey, Sonny. Hey, Lori. Hey. Ooh. Bye, Sonny. <laughs> he just got disintegrated. <laughs> oh? Hey, Amori, what are we doing with the door? There's the developments happening. Oh. Hey, Basil. Oh. They, f they found him. I don't think oh. they did. I think even Amori's starting to hallucinate a bit. I think... think Dream World... Oh, <laughs> oh look. <laughs> I guess Percy was in white space. The door is locked. Huh. Would you like to make toast? Toast. Oh, awesome. I'm glad that got clipped. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. Thanks, Anne. Am I in my eternal torment? Oh, we're not getting an allowance from neighbor anymore. Yeah, this is not a standard entrance to dream world. Yeah, and we can't leave today either. Oh. Yeah, Dreamworld's not having a good time. You feel better. Don't like that. Wait, we're still in two days left. This is a nightmare sequence. Oh my god, it is! It's a floating that You are all alone. Do you want to play hide and seek? Sure. Five, four, three. Two, one, go. What are we hiding and seeking with? The mirror itself? I don't know. 
with yourself, I guess. I guess? That's... even the ball's gone. Oh, there it is. I'm here. Found you. Do you want to play again? Let's do this three times and see if the rule of three does anything. Not, I say check Basil's house. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. We're gonna go down to Basil's as soon as we play with the mirror a few more times, because I don't trust this thing. I, I don't trust anything. My hand is in front of the screen. <laughs> Ash is perfectly prepared to fight off of the ch to fight off Calabar if she shows up again. I'm gonna attack the entity with my fists. <laughs> I hate the video games. Yeah. All right. I'm curious if something happens if we play with the mirror enough. All right. One more go, and then I think that's it. Like we have to be pretty close to this thing, just resetting to the original spot. Yeah. See, it's just back down to here. Played hide and seek ourselves. Well, go see our good friend Basil. Dull knife, worn and hard to use. You can no longer see your reflection. However, our attack has gone up to nearly 50, so you know what? I think we're pretty good in that scenario. <laughs> oh. A thick fog envelops the entire forest. A more you will not go. All right. I think we're going to get pushed towards the ocean, if I had to guess. Yeah. Because that's the only place. Around. That's the only place that isn't forest. Oi, Percy! Let me back in. Nothing. Come on, man. Yeah, no. I'm glad I caught that we're still in two days left, because this is absolutely just a nightmare sequence. Alright. Percy, Ooh. Percy, Percy, where are you? What what hell does this game have? Oh. Hey, Mari. A pail and shovel. Amori, you're here. I'm so glad you found me. Hell, Aubrey, Hero, and all the children are gone. There's a thick fog enveloping the entire forest. Everywhere. It's gonna jump scare us. <laughs> except here. Maybe our friends are somewhere across the water. Let's find them together. You want to join me? Yeah, sure. Thanks, little brother. I knew I could count on you. I'll keep you company so you're not alone. I know you really hate that. Mari's going to drown in this water. I guess that that might be the the association we're going with. Ah. As a note, I cannot open the menu anymore. Oh, good. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. <laughs> you... Steady your heartbeat. Don't be afraid. Wait, has it been Mari giving us the instructions during all the nightmare sequences? That was my assumption. Yeah. Uh, I... I had a feeling, but yeah. It's not as scary as you think. We already had our nightmare sequence, there's no reason to do this again. You are no longer afraid of drowning. Just need to, to get it in, in Dream World too. Well this this game. Alright, do you think we'll be able to get to that bit with the plank? With the R key? That maybe. There is nothing here. I'm going to take it to mean there's literally nothing there. That, that's probably the implications. I think Dream World was hitting its limits. I cannot open the W or Q keys either. I can't um, open the world map or the hangman. We are in a non-standard zone. Oh. That's a lot of shadow children. It, it sure is. And they all kind of look like Mari. They sure do. 
oh, we're going to get into this fog bank, and then we're going to find out Mari's not behind us, and then we're going to frantically search for her. I can words. We're going we're gonna to have a, a fun time. We're going to go to the beach. All the shadows are disappearing as we get close to them. You know, I made a joke about how, like, we're just not going to have a dream sequence. Well, we're right, in a sense. We sure are not having that. Why am I allowed to get into the water here? For fun. It's like, I... maybe this will have uh, more stuff in, in normal dream world. There's something over here. There is. I had a feeling. We couldn't go down or up, so we had to go left. Oh. Oh. Something stares at you from the other side of the screen. A dirty wardrobe. It's empty inside. An unmade bed. It hasn't been used in years. A stool on its side. This is Mari's room. Yeah. Like it, it. You found dead batteries. Yahoo! Well. Oh, hey, hey. Shadow Child. Mm. I, I missed that Shadow Child. Where was it? Uh, top left corner. It showed up right, fun. As, right as we were leaving. A cool, fun game. I love playing video games with Ooh. my friends. Here's an old crone. Have you seen my grandson? That's Basil's grandma, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, that would, would make sense. Something stares at you. A dirty wardrobe. It's empty. An unmade bed. Hasn't been used. Nothing. Is Inch. that thing on the floor new? I don't think so. I think that's just a pillow. Either okay. way, I can't interact with it, so... God, I... Like, whatever happened with Mari, it's gotta be something... real... uh... unsettling. All right, welcome to the other side of this. We, we crossed the, the lake. We saw two. I'm more than willing to bet there might have been something up. Oh, whatever. Amori, I'm so proud of you. You swam all the way here, even though he's always been terrified of water. But there's still one big thing you're afraid of, isn't there? Something a little bit hard to overcome. Hand is back in front of the screen. This game can do vibes like nothing else. <laughs> this game is producing the... I am uncomfortable with the energy in the studio. The R key found at the end of the plank. Or beyond the map of the world. Aubrey, Kel, Hero. Nothing. Oh? I think I recognize... Ah... Huh. Ooh. A fire, Aubrey, Kel, Hero. Or, not a fire, that's like... I'm not sure, a watermelon? Mm. It's it's a little hard to make things out with all the, the fog. Um... Okay, so there's a shadow child there, but it looks like... Looks like something might have keeled over there. Yeah. Whatever's down there, it's not a standard shape, and we've never seen anything like it here in Dream World. <laughs> Sand. <laughs> hey, Webbed is a very cutesy game. Where it you is, play as the spider. It's got, it's got funny little spiders in it, don't it? There it is. Amori, 
It seems that you've forgotten something important. I don't like how you don't have a fucking portrait, Mari. Are you Wait, okay what with that? To your portrait friend? I'm not too sure. Thanks, Mari. You've seen this curtain once before. The last time we went to the lake. This is my stop, though. I know I shouldn't have come. It just gets a little lonely without everyone. It's not my place to say anymore, but... I hope you're still there, Sunny. I really miss you. I'm, I'm being sold on the game, Sand. I'm, you've convinced me. Goodbye, little brother. So she did drown to death. Cool. I, yeah, I guess so. I don't like how that curtain was... I don't like how that exact curtain was in the piano room, though. Sure was. Sure was there. Alright, give it to me, Percy. What? What hell awaits us? Well. Well. <laughs> oh god, we've got the snake eater ladder again. I'm still in a dream, snake eater. Anglerfish. Angler, angler. It's fine, they're in the shadows. Oh wait, do we have we have our menu back, cool. M. We we need M. We need it to, to complete the, the thing. Spending time with a frog. Ribbit. Waiting for something to happen. Don't mock me. Oh, I didn't like that noise. There's so many funny fun noises. Five keys left. Can you? There's, there's a, a hole fun... here. Look into the hole. And in front of the... Hey, Percy. Ooh. These holes have gotten worse. They have. They're steadily getting getting much worse. We're so close to filling up the hangman. And look, we're somewhere now. Under, yeah. under this place. This is dark world. We're in the ocean, having a fun time. Still, still no fun music. This lane's carpool only, kid. Come back when you've got friends. Hey kid, you wanna go somewhere cool? You should go to the last resort. It's the hottest, trendiest place to be these days. I can take you there if you want, kid. It's all the rage. Come on. Don't be shy. I don't bite. Much. Buddy, I don't wanna go with you. Oh, you don't trust this man with your life? I don't trust anything called the last resort. Hey kid, you wanna ride back to the deep well? I'll drive you as much as you want. It ain't a big deal to me, I get paid salary. Let's keep looking. I'm betting you we're not allowed- I'm betting you the only way we're allowed to leave is through the deep well. Or... Does it loop? Not yet it hasn't. I think there's only two ways out of here, which is either to go to the deep well- Oh hey, we found a clam. Awesome. Endless highway! I believe the deep well is where we started, because we went into the, the, the well. Yeah, deep well's where we started. I guess we're going to the last resort. <laughs> A little bumpy, but not all that bad. Come back anytime, kid. Oh. 
Cal! Cal? Cal, my good friend Cal? Hey, Mori, there you are. Where have you been, buddy? While you were gone, everyone got tricked into signing contracts. So, we all have jobs now. Oh no, the child labor force. We're growing up so fast. My job is to point people to the last resort. And that's where I work. <laughs> oh, hey, Mari. There it is. I think I missed Mari. Oh, there she is. Hanging out. Chill now, Max, and relax and all cool. But I gotta say, this job thing isn't all it's cut out to be. <laughs> so why don't we get everyone to quit and get the heck out of here? Yours been traveling a lot for work lately, but I know for sure that Aubrey's working on the fifth floor of the last resort. We should go find her first. Yeah, we need her to get this watermelon. Haunting us. Hey, you! Yeah, you there with the stove expression. It looked like you want some fresh milk, fresh from Sea Cow Farms. It's the freshest fresh milk and will surely be refreshing for only 500 clams. You got rotten milk. It's the freshest! Well. I mean, yeah, look how good is it? <laughs> it's fresh. Peel tin juice plus unknown. I'm assuming it's like a major stats down. Presumably. Hey you! Yeah, you there. I have a very unique soda made from the finest of butt peaches. <laughs> <laughs> Screw, we got money. Let's get scammed. So many. You got peach soda. You'll love the taste. It's the butts, and I mean that in a good way. I mean peach soda's not I mean peach soda doesn't sound that bad. Yeah, that's 60% of juice. That's pretty good. Oh, you know, the butt peach. Hey, you. Yeah, you there. You wanna pose? Oh my god. Awesome, thanks. It's right over... <laughs> I bet you he didn't even have a way to stop us. We just oh, gave him 100 not. clams because we could. We're feeling charitable. Honestly. Completely organic bottled water. <laughs> sure. We've got money. You're, you're every con man's dream. <laughs> hey, you. I got some good quality dynamite. No, thank you. We already have dynamite. Our emotional support, Kel, is back. Hey, Mari. Look who finally decided to show up. Amori. It's so good to see you again! What is it, Amori? Have you figured out I'm not the same Mari as the one who left? Aren't you happy to see your big sister? Oh, that's just Amori being Amori. You can't blame him for the way he looks. Anyway, as I was just saying, working pays the bills, but it's not very exciting. So, me and Amori are gonna go get Aubrey and Hero, and then we're gonna find Basil? Oh yeah! That's what we were going to do. <laughs> Always happy to help. Let me know if you need anything else, okay? Now, nah, don't worry about it, Mari. The boss loves me. We'll be in now the last resort real quick, no problem. Okay, if you say so, Kel. Come on, Amori. Can't wait for you to meet the boss. He's awesome. Please tell me this is the boss from, like, the first day. <laughs> That'd be fun. Also, I don't like how it seems like we're forgetting about Basil now. It's, it's very interesting how the, the driving force of the plot in, in Otherworld has been falling apart. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Affirmative. Roger that. Grain juice. It's not for kids. Heh. <laughs> Man, that is one good joke. What a good freaking joke. What lies at the bottom of the ocean and twitches? A nervous wreck. Excellent. 
Cool, that's the joke that's going to get us a prize for sure. Alright, what else have we got? Caution, pool's under construction. We're underwater. How much do you need? Hey, you kids here on vacation or you want staff? All this construction going on, they can at least invest in some uniforms. Ah, it's nice to finally take a break. Are you from the city too? You look like a couple of city kids. The food's good, but the sewage is horrible, am I right? Um... Thank you, pool. Love the face. Uh, hey, no splashing in the pool, okay? Yeah, toilet ramen has been a staple of this game so far. Oh, the pool's haunted. Awesome. Pool's haunted. Pool's haunted. Hey, Percy, are you down here? He mean. Oh. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> Welcome to Ghost Party. I love these little sub areas. They never make any sense. They're wonderful like that. Let me just go quickly get the O key. Just pick up a funny letter. Four keys left. Oh, we really are getting there. What's at the bottom of the hole? What have we got this time? I don't trust these, I don't trust these, I don't trust these, I don't trust these. Hey, what could possibly be wrong with this hole? Hate you. Everyone... Hate you. Killing you. Attacking you. A videotape labeled Amori. A videotape labeled Basil. Ooh. Yeah, we only had one choice there. Basil, my good friend Basil. Let's see what's up. Ooh, having a normal one. Well, <laughs> I wonder if, I'm curious what the Amori tape would- Oh! Oh, sir! Ooh. Sir, I don't think you're- I don't think you're alive. My goodness, what impeccable timing. I seem to have found myself in quite the predicament. I've sent letters to a whole number of acquaintances, asking them to attend this elegant feast- All the hats, babe! Pay off hat, pay off! But as of this moment, not a single invitee has made an appearance. Not one! This is preposterous. A lesser ghost would be enraged, but my finer senses tell me that they may have simply become lost on the way here. You see, when I sent out my invitations, I had forgotten to include directions to the venue. Being a true gentleman and host, I refuse to start this party until all of my guests have arrived. Would you be so kind as to help my guests find their way here? Thank you, good sir. Here's some maps with directions to my party. It's down to my own personal top hat seal of approval. We got six spooky maps. Please deliver these maps to each of my guests. They will then find their way here on their own, surely. That definitely gotta be one of the more involved side quests. Oh, for sure. Oh look, it's all the food items. That's fun. Ghost party! Ah yes, a very long hero sandwich. You and your friends feel like new. Uh, good for you, buddy. Ooh, Jash! I am Jash of many talents and master of many trades. Okay, so this is how we can just buy like a pile of items. Let's buy one of these. God, considering we have to like fight bosses to get some of these, they're pretty rare, so party Jash is actually pretty good. Oh, hey, Stan. Ash, Stan has you pegged. Listen. <laughs> don't, don't even worry about it. Let's see, rotten... Oh, cool. We definitely awesome. got scammed a bit there. 
Just we a just bit. Had... Ooh, melon smoothies. I mean, I had to see. I bet you there's an achievement if I go buy the dynamite from that last dude, just to say I got scammed by all of them. Oh, for sure. Sure. Nope. Ah, well, we still got 2,500. We're good. <laughs> oh, Sand, that's... Hmm, that's a very interesting connection. Wait, who are we connecting drowning and clams to? It's like the currency is something you find in water and someone drowned. Fair and enough. Especially in this area because you are finding clams on the ground. Yeah. No skills. Telephone calls up the wazoo. A money machine. I'm gonna be honest, I'm not a huge fan of the gator guys. Oh, shit. <laughs> well, they're not a fan of you either. This is as far as you go. Mr. Jossum's not gonna be happy to see you again. I love this extremely, like, stock photo casino. Really? The game feels really loud to me today. Attack the psychic beings. Push over! <laughs> You're simply too powerful. It was all those bears. Today, I accidentally bumped into one of the staff, so she called me a nincompoop and headbutted me across the room. I knew headbutts could hurt so bad. I sure didn't. Good for her. Alright. Oh god. I am done with these guys. I bet you there's an achievement for buying from every one of them, but also... I think I booked the wrong bus. This isn't what this place looked like on the advertisements. Hey, slot machines. Awesome. Oh my god. Finally, the Pokemon gambling we all want. I went to this costing. Sure. Alright, I think that's enough gambling. <laughs> You, you gotta get the trick down, the, the fable didn't appear yet. This joint just ain't cut out like these folks are making it to be. I want my clams back, you hear? Hey buddy. Who said you could leave your post? Get back to work! Well, I think you're, you're bringing a lot of problems to our little group. Hell's playing slots. Of course he is. Frankly, Amori's follow-up means he basically has a free hack away now. He's too powerful. All right, pal, you're not making it past me this time. They'll, they'll get him next time. Kel's playing slots. Good job, Kel. This is definitely what we should be doing with our funding. <laughs> like, I, I think Kel might have some legitimate memory problems from being at this place. It's... Is the fact that uh, he couldn't remember a basil and the fact that he's playing slots. And lost money, too. Don't Hell. forget that. Oh, we can't take the hits. We got scammed by like eight people on the way in. <laughs> yeah, Kel, seriously. Still, that explains where everyone went, so they all got fucking recruited. Alright, you know, I'm gonna skip talking to these people, because, uh, time limits and all that. Fair. Pretty. 
a chill battle track for this area. It is. It's like overworld music. Perhaps. Yeah, we have the points to spare. This is just a cheap version of Hathaway. So that's nice. Not to mention we're getting 300 clams every time. Amori, yeah. this is probably not a good time, but I really, really have to go to the bathroom. As I always say, when you gotta go, you gotta go. Oh, fine. That was a classic quote. Ah. We can't get Kel to go in the pee. Oh, hey! Oh, awesome! The pee! Hold we on, Amori. This will just take a minute. Ah, much better. You notice Kel didn't wash his hands. Punishable. By death. Man, these are getting more and more ominous as the time goes by. This is definitely just to force you to get the pee key. Oh, definitely, babe. Hole. I know. I'm doing a check. So we need the W, the T, and the S. Yeah, they're definitely funneling you into them now. We need the gut of a whale, a large bubbly tank, and a live shell. All of which we're going to find down here. Yeah, they want you to, to find these. Oh, welcome to Hole. Ooh. Love Hole. Ah! Oh, hey, Calamari! Get her out of here! Get her out of here! <laughs> Well, you made Kel wash his hands. <laughs> awesome. Hey there, good looking. Good now he's talking himself up. That's fun. Anyway, yeah, let's just. Yeah, let's do. I want to do a quick check, but also I don't want to fight Gator guys all day when we're already missing half of our combat force. Once we get Aubrey back, these guys will go by like nothing, but for now. Which reminds me, I just realized we never got to, we never actually got to get into a fight with that bust of, uh, Sweetheart. Don't get tragic. Tragedy of tragedies. We gotta get Aubrey back just for that. Level 24. A very expensive and controversial art piece. Oh, hey, Mari. Oh, hey, Mari. Isn't this a cool elevator? It smells kind of like perfume and smoke. Oh, hi, Mari. Hello, you two. Let's see now. So, if I got this straight, Aubrey's on the fifth floor. Hit every button. Make this ride miserable. Why isn't this working? <laughs> oh yeah, I totally forgot. We need a cool keycard for this. They took mine away because I kept losing it. I swear they're disappearing on their own though. Let's try looking around the other floors for one. There's got to be a cool keycard around here somewhere. Hi, little brother. You feeling a bit better now? Why don't you enjoy a nice picnic with me? That always seems to cheer you up. I would, but there's nothing to do a picnic option. We, we need all our friends for this. I don't like how we're still in two days left either. Yeah, we have not hit one day left yet. Let's go Very to the basement. Interesting. Oh! <laughs> I'm Burt Moe and I won't be anyone but me. It's the Plum. <laughs> the best D&D <laughs> monster. Oh my god. We got a punching bag. That is... Yeah, that's definitely like an Aubrey thing, considering one of her weapons is a body pillow. Aubrey's too strong. You found a poetry book. I don't know what it's for, but we found it. I think 
that's just an item that either neutralizes or makes people sad. Fair enough. I love we're just allowed to loot these lockers, by the way. What are they gonna do, stop you? They're not liable. They already said that. <laughs> hey, would you sue, would you sue the, the nice casino after it already told you they're not at fault for this? They're the poor innocent casino. Oh, we got some booze too. You, you promised you wouldn't be mad at them if someone took all your shit. Yeah. Oh, fish taco, <laughs> nice. Fruit juice, it's not the kids. <laughs> well, we saved that guy from hearing it. I got everyone pizza. Mmm, pizza. Mood. Take it easy. We ain't gonna fight ya. At least not while we're off the clock. <laughs> you said it, man! Our stocks are falling. I mean, rising at an alarming rate. Stocks are up. <laughs> the graph is upside down. That's very cute. Employee of the month. Wow. Huh. I don't like how we're in deep well, because isn't deep... Because deep well... Deep well is. Deep well sure is. I mean, for one, we already heard about how there's this dark world that we definitely aren't supposed to be in. Yeah, the, the dark world where all the pits keep coming from. Yeah, where all the pits keep going to. Alright, let's see. What's here? A child. Clean, and clean, and clean, and clean. You got a cool key card. Okay, cool. Now we can hit low five. We should be able to get to the fifth floor from the elevator now. Let's go find Aubrey. The boss tried to put me to use, but when he realized I couldn't do anything, he told me to be a bed tester. Mm, yep, this bed sure feels- God, I want to be a fucking bed tester. <laughs> She's living her best life. This is all natural. Simply apply as directed. Check out these- <laughs> Oh, gods. Yeah, that's an infomercial, alright. That's what they play before Food Network kicks in. It's just all infomercials. A doll with an empty face. It doesn't look like it belongs here. Would you like to throw it away? Sure. <laughs> this will have no consequences. The faceless doll examines your features. Thank you. I'm the Rock Paper Scissors Champion! If you beat me a Rock Paper Scissors, I'll give you my entire life savings. <laughs> sure, throw paper. Ready, and... Huh. So this is defeat. You have humbled me, Challenger. As promised, you may take my entire life savings. One clam. No, three clams! <laughs> Please don't spend it all in one place. Yeah, sure, I can buy some nice rotten milk with this, thank you. <laughs> Look, he knows what the people want, and the people want rotten milk. Alright, let's check out- let's check out the rest of the floors, just to make sure there isn't a key here. And then we'll go pick up Aubrey, probably on Thursday, considering I'm getting close to your time, huh? Yeah... The patrons at this place sure know how to make a mess. Having a job sure is tough. I hope Nose is doing okay with it. Yeah, Nose is doing fine. He's running front desk. <laughs> oh, my sweet sons are also hard at work. You better not be causing them any trouble, or else. I'll smack you all the way to tomorrow. Alright, so we're definitely gonna fight her once we get the whole party back. Jam guy! <laughs> hey kids, I'm the life jam guy. I sell life jam. It really works. Would you like to buy some life jams? Only 250. Life Jam. It really works. Good for him. I'm sorry, we got a clam coin? It's a collectible. You need it. Increases clams earned in battle. Oh, that's so helpful. <laughs> Whatever will we do, we have under 4,000 clams. We have no money. It's very funny to think about, considering the fact that we are definitively quite rich. And we, and we got- oh no, oh, we got a no. Oh, no, get out of there! 
five defense po- Holy shit! The fedora's good, actually. Unfortunately, we don't have a single character who can take advantage of it. They decided to come here on our honeymoon because they- awful. Because they offered a free room and a luxury resort experience. Luxury in my butt, this place is shoddy as it gets. I can already see the paint coming off the walls. Honestly, I don't mind this place at all. It's not, up, it's not bad at all for being free. Even if the kiddie pool outside is haunted. Ah, uh, that's cute. Lamb and wolf for a couple. Oh. Love wins. Well, moving on. Oh. Well. Oh. <laughs> they, they haven't. This one just needs more time in the microwave. So Put it I, back. I bumped into mom on the way up here, and she won't stop nagging me. Wearing shades inside is bad for your eyes, she says. I can't take off these shades just like that. They're like a part of me. Man, mom's visiting again. She must be empty nesting hard. What? Mom's here? I gotta go say hi later. We have found the mama's boy. We we did it. We done it. Ooh. I was wondering about that, because we definitely didn't find Altic's ghost. Don't mind me, I'm just a lost floating mustache, caring about his day. Well, hold on a sec, what do we have here? Directions to Top Hat's party? Well, gee, I'd better skedaddle. The party doesn't start until I arrive. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. Awesome. Oh, hey, welcome to the construction zone. Let's go check out the other one real quick. I don't like that level 4, so... Oh, hi, Drenchu. Welcome to the chat. Oh! Welcome, welcome. For the extra hard nights. <laughs> they you get an extra hour in the ball pit. <laughs> yeah, we found it. <laughs> oh, right, I forgot. Almost forgot our How ramen. How could we forget our, our dear friend Toilet Ramen? A locker, a locker. What else have we got? <laughs> Fucking Pokemon <laughs> trainer ass. <laughs> What's this? Lucky Slice, an attack that's stronger when more he's happy. That, yeah, sure, fuck okay, it, let's go for it. We turned on Lucky Slice for a reason. We did it because it is simply good. Also, there's that happy accuracy. God, the, 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 the accuracy dip on happiness is just gonna screw you over when you need it most. Yeah, it's not even that good, honestly. It's good to have you here. You are in the, the later half of the screen, because I do need to dip in a little bit, but we will be doing this again on Thursday. Yeah, we're getting pretty close to the end here. Well, thanks for the follow! Oh yeah, thank you! We can never say no to a new follower. <laughs> you know what? That's one step closer to affiliate. Yeah! One step down, only 31 to go. Is the best. You and your friends feel like new. Hi, little brother. We're seeing a lot of each other lately, huh? Anyways, come sit. It's not like you'd turn down a picnic. And look you there. You've got to admit, the view is pretty nice. <laughs> a, a lot more Mari. Uh her room, like, the saturation of her in this level is, like, way more than it has been. Yeah, it really has been. Uh, <laughs> glad we can be a nice stream for you, Rinchu. Yeah, we, we do our best to make a chill space. Yeah, which is why Calamari is no longer allowed on screen. <laughs> Banned. <laughs> I'm just about finished with our tribute to our employee of the century. Look oh at me making God. statues and stuff. Never thought I could actually do it, but the boss always believed in me. 
He's definitely going to get fired if he doesn't make these statues. <laughs> I can't wait to see the actual the boss, by the way. Engineering is like a puzzle. Very excited. And I love puzzles. Alright, so anyway, we beat the Pokemon trainer, so what's up here? If I can stop sprinting for a minute. It's a daunting level. The boss used to have me work in the security department, but they said I was too soft. I heard they made Burly head of security. They say she's got a stiff upper lip. Well, combo meal, a smoke stick, <laughs> you know, all the greats. All the classics. I still can't get over that fucking Pokemon trainer ass encounter. <laughs> Living his best life. A coat rack. There's another one. Here he comes. <laughs> I'm betting you we're supposed to actually have fucking... Oh, definitely. We're gonna have to fight all these people again when we, when yeah. we get the party back together. We're definitely... I get the feeling we were supposed to have gotten Aubrey first, but also, if I risk it... Why would we ever do anything efficiently? If we did stuff efficiently, we wouldn't be the Owl the Streaming Service with the very unfortunate acronym. It's perfect. <laughs> I wouldn't have it any other way. Oh, I just realized they're karate chomping. <laughs> That's fun. It definitely goes a lot faster if we actually use emotions. Imagine that. Using the core mechanic makes things go faster. Shockingly enough. Yeah, we can't get that until we get Aubrey. I get the feeling we're about to run into, like, a hard cap on how far we can progress like this. Probably, considering we're already missing out on, like, half the items. Alright, let's see what's past this fight, and then we'll go back and save if there's nothing of interest. But yeah, be sure to come back next week and see if we've gotten EDF set up. <laughs> the most chill game possible, right, babe? Ugh, you, you should keep that game away from me. <laughs> yeah, it really depends on if Nashi feels like it, though, because they do want that to be like a collab. Yeah. We need more Nashi on this channel, she's fun. Yeah, I'm definitely going to be streaming Stardew with her tomorrow if that still happens. I just Hell yeah. Yeah, we physically can't get past this point without Aubrey. <laughs> this is the saddest moment. Well, ripped to all our ripped to all our chances of success, we have officially perished horribly. <laughs> I find it interesting This is the cruel and unjust world. I find it kind of interesting how we just cannot have a picnic with Mari anymore. I think Amori's a little too freaked out by what happened earlier. Yeah. It's, it's very interesting, the things they're doing with her this chapter. Alright, let's... Babe, we're still on two days left. We sure are. I'm counting this as a new chapter mentally, but it very much is the same one as the last one, ain't it? Alright, I think... I think it's probably a good idea to just cut it here. Yeah, because you don't know what cutscene Aubrey's gonna manifest. Yeah, not to mention... Because, like, at best, we've only got, like, ten minutes left before you need to leave, and it's no fun if you're not here. <laughs> Who would Aww. Calamari hang out with? Ooh. <laughs> Alright, everyone. This has been Amori. That stream title is very confusing, although I guess the water part's more accurate now. <laughs> you know what? There was water, so you get full marks. Yeah. Uh, welcome to the newest addition to our streaming service, Renshu. Yeah, it's nice having you here. We'll, we'll do more of this. Yeah, it's always fun to have more people. We'll be back here on Thursday at, well, pretty much the same time. Same time, same channel. Yeah, we'll be here at 11.30-ish. <laughs> well, anyway, have a good day, everyone. Bye! Bye!